I'm 28. 28, what you do for a living? I am asset protection. Um, it's like Walmart warehouse. And so I'm in school. What, honey? Too. It's called asset protection. It's like security for a Walmart uh, warehouse. Come, I'm gonna put security for Walmart. Okay. Warehouse. Do you have any kids? Yes, I have two. Two boys. How old are your two boys? Three and seven. Three and seven, both by the same man? No. no. My oldest uh, son's father passed away. And then my, my um, second child's father, I ended the relationship like three years ago. When you were pregnant? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you said with my, my oldest son's father? No, you said you ended the second one three years ago and your child's three. Yeah. Y'all broke up before you had the baby? Yeah. Okay. Y'all co parent well? Not really. Kind of. I tried to, but he kind of still wants the relationship, but I, I don't. Why? What happened? Uh, narcissistic and controlling, uh, somewhat abusive emotionally and physically. So it wasn't for me. For you. Okay. Is it Marissa? Yes, Mar Marissa. Marissa. And what's your zodiac sign? Scorpio. Scorpio. So we got Marissa, Chicago, 28 Scorpio, security for a Walmart warehouse, model two kids, three and seven. Um, you ready? Let's do it. Why? What kind of man are you looking for? Um, um, I'm looking for a man that's going to love me for me. Um, let's see. I want him to be thoughtful, loving, um, respectful, re respectful, sorry. <laughs> um, you know what I mean? And let me see. Let's see. I'm sorry, I'm nervous. I'm on quiet. You probably see my buddy. Okay. All right. Um, what else? Uh, I want him to be protective. Um, have kids also, because I would like a man that being a parent is about. Say last time. What's the last thing you said? I would like him to be a parent, like a father, a father. So that way he understands what being a father is about. So you want? All right. Hell. So she two for two. She got small <laughs> kids too. So here listen are. here, man. <laughs> Was she having a hard time saying respectable or respectful? One or the other, she could not like listen here, man. We understand stumbling on words, but respectable or respectful? Like there ain't a lot of weird syllables going on, like nevertheless. <laughs> yeah, words are hard, Rain. <laughs> you know, here we go. Sister got her natural hair. That's a plus. She's 28. That's a plus ish compared to the 40 50 year old women come up here however we see symptoms of wide back wide backism she up here with no accountability you know her one baby daddy got deleted or passed away wasn't natural causes that's what that gonna show and the last one they that knocked her up he still wants a relationship but she don't want it because he's controlling he and narcissistic and then did she go to say how? Because he's kind of physically and mentally abusive. Kinda. I ain't never somebody come on now. I ain't never heard somebody say he kinda physically and meant what, what kinda did he almost hit you? <laughs> did he almost yell at you? What are we talking about? <laughs> so here we go. We're gonna let her keep going. She cooking now. <laughs> oh, Quisha. I'm going to have kids already? Yes. Okay. Um, um, what are your deal breakers? Um, A smoker, someone that is aggressive. Mm. And someone that doesn't know how to take care of themselves. Uh, like, fi uh, not financially, but, well, yeah, financially and, um, like, someone that doesn't smell good, I guess, and bad breath. Someone that doesn't smell good? The one that does smell good, that he, if he doesn't smell good, then that's still break. Okay. Um, so you look a certain way. Um, I want him to be taller than me. I'm five five, so maybe the five nine at least. And then he might be facial hair. 
No, um, you he could be what? black, Latino. I said facial hair. Okay, so you like facial hair. Okay, and what else? And he could be black, white, Latino, doesn't matter. You're open to all ethnicities? Yes. Okay. Um, should he, should he make a certain amount of money? Um, um I'll say 60K and a good credit score. 60K and a good credit score. So she looking for a white guy making 60K with a good credit score that want to be a stepkid to stepdad to two kids. I don't know. It's over, man. <laughs> what? When did she come up with that? Uh, I apologize for asking questions. I already know the answers to. The guy in the credit, echo chamber, circle jerk, my, my apologies. That's my apologies. Yeah. She was sitting there talking with her thick neck friends. Why is she standing like that? And she said, yeah, you know what I'm going to do, girl? I done got knocked up by two nug nugs, but I got the remedy. I'm going to get me a Brad with a good credit score, and he going to be smitten by this, by this, uh, <laughs> by this black oak kudakata. And he going to pay take care of me and my bastard children. Good credit score. I'll be in, she said, I'll be in the Escalade in no time. <laughs> this is wild. Hit the like button if you're just coming in. Stand up now. Let's see. <laughs> there we Let's go. do the Kendrick cam. Okay. Let's see. Hold on. I'm losing hope. Okay. Let's see. You see okay. We can see you, honey. All right, turn around. No, no we cannot. That ain't it. Uh, she got like a two-year-old. Why? How y'all got these small kids and single? That's amazing. I couldn't imagine. I could not. But this, this is a norm. <laughs> Sisters being up here, two for two and up. They don't care. It was. Listen here, man. For those of you that don't know, it was a woman up here that she wasn't even healed from giving birth i swear to goodness like she was weeks out weeks not months <laughs> weeks and she said i need me a man with my <laughs> with my sewn up and tattered kudakata amazing and at this point uh mrs locks to smile you know no bread no water just meat <laughs> that's, that's, that's it. it that's it it's unfortunate man it is, but they do it to themselves. The dating market owes none of us, nor is it giving any understanding, sympathy, nor empathy. And they don't care. You two for two. We said on uh, the one brother said today on the panel over there, hemp. Two for two over. Good luck. <laughs> so shout out to Izzy DeVoe. He says, I'm in the bind, Nate, some other time. All right, turn around on him. Okay. okay. So we got Marissa, correct? Yes, ma'am. Marissa, Chicago, 28, Scorpio, Walmart, Warhouse. Um, make at least 60K, minus two kids. Do you want more kids? Mm, if, if I get married, maybe, but no, not really. Okay, okay. Um, when was your last relationship? I'll say with my child's father. That's last All right, one. three years ago. Yeah. You don't have to answer. But I'm going to ask, when's the last time you was intimate with someone? A couple of weeks ago. Who's that guy? guy You're nasty. Watching? Why not? I found out that he had his uh, girlfriend still with him. How'd you find out? Uh, He kind of confessed to me. So, But he said they weren't together. But How long were y'all dating for? No, we weren't dating. It was just, we were just kind of intimate with each other. Friends with benefits? Yeah. Okay. And when did, so it was a couple of weeks ago. When did he tell you he's with his girlfriend? We were on the phone. So has he just decided to be back with her? No, I just stopped talking to him. Got you. Um, okay. Three flaws you have to work on. Um, being, I'll say empathetic. Like I'm not, I feel like I need to understand people's feelings sometimes um being patient and uh, i guess a procrastinator procrastinator 
And why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Because I'm fun, funny, um, uh, I love, I, you know, love to have fun. I got my passport. I love to travel. So I have a good head on my shoulders. So. All right, let's do it. What's the age range you would date? 28. Um, I'll say 28 to 35. That's where you wrong. You 28, your old man's in his 40s, first of all. And, and some of y'all, dear, saying she don't look bad. Well, she don't. You know, she got nice skin. Look like natural hair. And we keep telling y'all stop having these kids. And y'all act like it's not a huge detriment, especially small babies. Y'all crazy. Ain't nothing left for this sister. She 28, two kids. She two for two. And she just admitted to hunching about a week ago. And it wasn't a relationship. Kendra said, how long was y'all in a relationship? She said, she said, well, <laughs> it wasn't a relationship. You know, it was just kind of, she loves the word kind of. And I'm trying to tell you some people that use that kind of, they telling you half truths. It's kind of the freaking truth, but it's, it ain't, <laughs> it's kind of a lie as well. She up here, oh, you know, we just, kind of had an intimate moment you y'all was <laughs> kind of had an intimate moment y'all went brazy on one another shut up shut uh -huh. up <laughs> and shout out to project leroy you seen enough he says nothing to see here chicago skip her now so and another thing she wasn't going to say how she wanted to divest Shout out to my guy O'Shea Duke Jackson over there. He put together a masterful video. I don't know how many of y'all seen it about the one sister divesting. One of y'all was asking us the other day about it and, you know, trying the to sister to get this. Yeah, trying to figure out how to say it for YouTube purposes, but she got all, you know, um, discombobulated. <laughs> yeah. And they was finding like her body parts throughout the city. And she decided, young girl, like 19 years old, decide, pretty girl. I wish she went. I don't know what she's thinking. She just went home with this Brad, you know, went on a date with that brother. And then O'Shea was running down a list of this stuff going on, man. So, yeah, divest if y'all want. It's not that, ain't it? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, I seen that. That was intense. And then they show the character, the, the monster that did it. And you like, hmm, ain't surprising. <laughs> yeah, yeah, listen here. It's unfortunate. That's why it's not so funny at times. Because, man, listen here, man. Sister, stop. Stop rejecting your original protector, man. Y'all, I, I hope y'all don't keep learning the hard way. I'm leaving it at that. Man. So, like I said, shout out to Project Leroy coming through. For her, now we at the point in the show where we're going to start making examples, Mr. Walker. There we go. Yes. I done had it. You up here talking about weird arrangement with Brad that he did not agree with Bonquisha. It's over. You two for two. You a serial hunter. We looking at you. You freshly glazed. You right now you staring. You freshly glazed. It's over. <laughs> so with that being said. Unfortunate, man. Yep. Examples all 2024 for up here freshly glazed. Two for two. Talking about you going to divest and get you a Caucasian man with a good credit score and you just got clapped by Nug Nug weeks ago. That is not a tempting you know, argument at all. Ain't nobody buying that. But Nug Nug will. 